welcome back. Continuing the news. Repairs have started along sections of the main road in York Hill in St. Thomas. The error was one of several identified by the National Works Agency for defects after reports of subpar materials being used to rehabilitate the road. As we hear in this report, the work which recently started is being further delayed. Jamela Maitland explains. People who live and work in York Hill, St. Thomas, are being asked to expect delays to the road repairs in the area. I'm asking for patience, and we know that it's going to do, do properly now. The York Main Road to Seaforth was rehabilitated earlier this year as part of the Southern Coastal Highway Improvement Project. Soon after, it began showing signs of defects. It worsened after Hurricane Beryl. Really bad man, all my car, every pass we pass in a place of pay tear road. If you change all the mud, you know what I mean? They say look good, I had to maintain. Was it like this before yeah. burial or since burial it get like this? Well, burial don't make it worse. Because when the rain fall, water come off of them a place that I'm sure they road. The National Works Agency revealed that the contractors used subpar materials for the job. We would have picked up most of these defects in our previous routine inspections, they would have presented as cracks previously, but subsequent to burial, they were opened up and came out with our hair. So the instructions were given to China Harbor's construction team to repair our lives. The construction was subcontracted to a local contractor. Now, the project is being undertaken by its contractors, China Harbor Engineering Company, Czech. They revealed to us that there's another delay to the project. We're doing some work at the package 14 in Seaford, and we have uh, some delays and the work pertaining to material wise. Czech wasn't able to say how soon the materials would arrive to resume the work, only that other work is being done in the meantime. As it relates to the timeline for the completion of the project, it wasn't able to see either. Similar works are being done in Pamford. In the vicinity of Prospect Pen, more popularly known as Jamintel, is where majority of the repair is taking place. Minister of Works Robert Morgan says a two-month deadline has been given for the project. Jamila Maitland, TVJ News. In this 